everyday life isn't very romantic. Each day passes through, not the other way around. On the war front, it's me versus me. Me versus that assignment that becomes a dragon. Me versus that feeling that lingers like mud. Me versus that nap that becomes sleep. But everyday life doesn't have to be so bleak. We can relish in its simple things. Like the greens of nature around us. Or the spider that hangs by a thread. The raindrops singing in unison. Or the books that whisper yearnings to be read. Well, maybe everyday life is a little romantic. If you tilt your head a little to the right when you look at the forest of life. Then past the trees, there's always something to be grateful for. Family, friends, pets, health, literature, art, God, films, education. Everyday life for me is often boring, but when I take the time to sit down and write, I realize again and again, it's not such a horrible thing. Again and again, my eyes open to this truth. He said, write it on your heart that every day is the best day in the year. He is rich who owns a day, and no one owns a day who allows it to be invaded with fret and anxiety. Finish every day and be done with it. You have done what you could. Some blunders and absurdities no doubt crept in. Forget them as soon as you can. Tomorrow is a new day. Begin it well and serenely, with too high a spirit to be cumbered with your old nonsense. This day is too dear, with its hopes and invitations, to waste a moment on the yesterdays.